Hey guys, welcome back to Full Circle with Joyce. And uh, again, as we continue with our special New Year's Day show here, um, I want to introduce my next guest. He's a familiar face here on uh, Full Circle with Joyce. His name is Ashok Sunny. He's the head creative director at Ashok Sunny Tailored. Karibu Sunny to the show. Thank you very Happy much. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. <laughs> it's good to see you here. And with him, we want to talk about powerhouse suits for important business meetings. It is the brand new year. It is 2020. You guys have your goals written down. You're coming for your aspirations this year. And so it's important to look the part right as you're chasing those proposals as you're chasing those meetings we need to make sure that you also look the part and um you know a suit can really make or break a deal yes true right like yeah. you look very sharp right thank now. you thank you so you it, it really positions how someone takes you seriously or yeah, not doesn't because, it because uh, the first uh, the first sight is the first perception someone has of you true. so if you're in a good suit uh very very tailored looking very nice that's yeah can encourage someone to indulge you in anything. Yeah. yeah. And it's building your own personal yeah. brand. Yeah, true. Very, very important. Yeah. Okay. Well, you know what? Ashok looks too nice, so we can't just <laughs> let him sit down. <laughs> you need to stand up and show us this this suit of yours. Okay. I think this is the least color I've ever seen you in <laughs> from all the things. I feel like I've seen him in an orange shirt with a white collar before. I've never forgotten. <laughs> it, looked, it looked really good, though. Yeah. But this is probably the chillest I've seen you, but it still looks really nice. Thank you. Still has a pop of color. Yeah. It's yeah. wool. It's wool uh, mixed with a little bit of silk. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. So is that what's giving it that sort of yeah, yeah, it gives you that yeah, yeah, effect. yeah, that kind of feel. Okay. Yeah. It has like a little sheen to yeah, it. Yeah. It looks really nice. Thank you. And then tell me about your tie and your pocket square. Okay. What I usually like to do is uh, this is a this is a dull color. Yeah. Although the suit looks a bit silk, but it's a dull color. So mm -hmm. we just pop it a little bit with a white shirt and uh, this golden. Uh, I beautiful. call it vintage look. It's beautiful yeah, color. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. So it just brings out the pop in the color. Yeah. So it, uh, as long as you're wearing something very cool down, yeah. very toned down, but at least it's something popping outside. So we match it with the pockets here, which is just plain gold. Right. To make it look very busy because it's still a busy meeting. So is it, and thank you so thank much, you. you can have your seat. Thank you. Um, so is it that nowadays you don't, the tie and the pocket square don't have to be the same? No, it doesn't have to be. It just uh, depends on you and what you want. Mm -hmm. Because, uh, Trying to match everything looks a bit cliche. Okay. So most of the time, just work with something. It's a bit close. Yeah. It's a bit close to the color. Yeah. It brings out what you want to achieve, mm -hmm. but it still looks very nice. Okay. Yeah. And then your shoes, like you've kept it still fun. Yeah. Like you have <laughs> the striped socks. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I like it. So Thank it doesn't you. have to again be matchy. Yeah, very matchy. dull. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Very interesting. And so, you know, this year I'm sure you are saying, Watu lazima, Watu ah. masuti. <laughs> <laughs> but you, what you're trying to do is make it a bit more affordable because uh -huh. uh, going to a shop buying a woolen suit is very expensive sure. if it's imported. And most of the guys go to meetings because when you're going to a shop and buying a suit, you don't get your size. Yeah. Because our sizes are not the same as the ones that people are making outside there. Yeah. We're Africans. We have our different yeah, body yeah. types. So <laughs> you get a can go from China to the size 12. At a Yeah. So most of you see guys going to, to a business meeting with a blazer, a, 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 a different kind of shirt, khakis, because you're not getting a suit that can fit you. So that's what, that's a gap we're trying to bridge. Right. We're doing custom-made bespoke suits for your own at your at, at your own price range. Okay. Your own size. All right. Yeah. Well, uh, Ashok actually does have a treat for the ladies too, yeah. because yeah. even us girls, we need to rock it too. <laughs> okay. And uh, I'm gonna have our first model come on to set, and she is wearing a suit, a power suit for 2020. Certainly this would be a statement. Can you imagine seeing a lady dressed like this walking into a business meeting? You have to pay attention. Yes, because the thing is, uh, ladies are imagining these days becoming their own bosses. Mm -hmm. And uh, most of the time, to imagine tunakua. they are coming their own bosses because yes. it's an imaging trend. <laughs> ladies ladies are taking on their own, uh, they're starting their own businesses, yeah. taking on big things. Mm -hmm. So most of the time you see a lady with this kind of a suit, with this kind of an outfit, yeah, the tie makes it look a bit more manly, so it brings out the power. Right. So you see, so if you you, you look at the details on the on, on the blazer and the pants, you see that the the palazzo pants make it a bit more feminine. Yeah. Not very serious. Yeah. Even the print. Yeah. So it brings out the the it makes you look different, mm -hmm. and it brings out you as a person, your personality. Tell me about this. I mean, I feel like you have to be pretty confident to rock a look like this one too. Not necessarily. Because of the stripes. Not necessarily. 
because I see most of the ladies when it comes to wearing, they are not afraid to wear colors, mm -hmm. prints, and everything. Mm -hmm. So to to go away from the dull colors, the navy blue suit, the black suit, you need a lady. You need to bring out the personality of the lady as a lady. Yeah. So you walk out with the prints because even you see the fabric, it's a stretching fabric, but it's still a so suiting hot. fabric. I totally wear Yeah. So if you're curvy and you you you, want, you like your body, you like the way you are, you want to bring it out. Yeah. These are the kind of fabrics you should be working on. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, can you imagine if your boss is dressed like this? You tell me, Jimu. That's the idea. <laughs> You're really going to have to respect yeah, her. Yeah. And what sort of fabric do we have here? This is cotton, stretching cotton. Mm -hmm. But uh, with, the, with the stripes and everything, it, you can, with the density, you can make a, we can bring out a blazer and bring out the shape of the person very okay. nicely. Yeah. Okay. And even the tailoring, it's a, it's a, it's you, we use the structure of a male, the structure oh. of a male tailoring, okay. and we bring out the lady's suit. Okay. Yeah, so you can see the cut and everything. You can accentuate the curves of the lady very nicely. And the pants. I really yeah. like the design. Maybe you can <laughs> just turn a bit for us to see the leg. There you go. Yeah. It's sort of like a trumpet yeah, at the bottom. Yeah, yeah. Um, very cute and again brings out the femininity <laughs> yeah, to yeah. it because I guess if it was just a straight leg, it wouldn't look as yeah, nice, definitely. right? It'll just look normal and just a normal suit. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And here you've decided to accessorize or bring in the color through the yeah, shoes. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. You can you can bring the color through the shoes. You can bring the color through the blouse you're wearing or the tie. Mm -hmm. it just depends on how you want to work it out. You can even add an accessory on top like a hat or anything. Mm -hmm. Just depends on how you want to work it out. All right. And the kind well, of meeting you're going thank to. you so much. You look great. Oh, and let us suit you. Very very soon. <laughs> <laughs> that looks really cool. Um, all right. I think we're gonna get our third model ready in just a moment here. Yeah. Um, but do you think in 2020 now there are like either colors we should sort of stick away from? I hear every year there's like a color. Is or you know do we even follow those things or do you feel like people can just do whatever they want? I think with our market and our industry in terms of um, trying to avoid something. We should not because we are, we, we are still way back. We're still catching up. So I think we should embrace more, more mm -hmm. colors, more prints and everything so that we can at least grow. Because I think people are being open-minded these days in terms of fabric and patterns and everything. Yeah. So if you're doing more and you're embracing more, more, more people will come in and, and say, this is what you're supposed to wear. This is how you can wear it. So at least even stylists can know that they can get worth for what they're doing. Right. Yeah. And speaking of patterns, you know, it's a, it's a bit of a shame that here in Kenya, we only reserve like our kitenges for like weddings. For events and, and weddings. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> right? Like yeah. no, it's not like in the West and other parts of Africa where they really celebrate like wearing those fabrics. Yeah. Um, if someone was to think about putting Ankara on suits like for business meetings, do you think that would work? Uh, it, it actually depends on the meeting mm -hmm. because um, if it's just a normal uh, board meeting uh, in house, you can you can you can at least work with anything you want. Mm -hmm. If if it's uh, just a normal board meeting in in house in the corporate, but if you're meeting someone outside, if you're meeting another an, another company or anything, it's very yeah. hard to try and mix and play around with colors yeah. because you know the perception and everything. And depending they might on think what it's too casual because yes, yes. we associate yeah, it with yeah. like fun events yeah. okay so also very important then yeah. to yeah. be mindful yeah. um okay i think we can get our male model uh getting onto our circle here here he comes Weh. <laughs> Una come to a pesa. 2020 no jokes <laughs> 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 tell me about this look this is for the outgoing male mm -hmm. your, your business you're working every day but you want to look dapper yeah. Always. This is for, not for the bank. It's someone who works in a bank right. or, or a big corporate. This yeah. is someone who has their own business, running their own business, doing their own thing. But right. you always want to look dapper. Mm -hmm. This is the kind of look you can go for. Mm -hmm. It's just a black suit, but yeah. it has. when you come close, you can see the patterns on the suit. Oh, okay. Then yeah. the shirt is a bit busy because the mm -hmm. polka dot, mm -hmm. the tie. With the shirt, you don't need to do the tie. If you want to go all out, you want to look oh, dapper, so you, you work with the tie. Oh, you even just do it without? With, without the, the tie, okay, you can I just can do it with that. the shirt. Yeah. Would you still keep the pockets? Yeah, clean? yeah. Just mm -hmm. to, to bring out, look like someone you know what you're doing. Right. Yeah. Right. Yeah. And then the shoes. Yeah. This, the, the shocks, the atty shocks, the socks. The happy socks. <laughs> uh, showing is like still on trend. It's still on trend, but depends on the person also. Because when you come as a client, the first thing we do, we connect with you on a personal level. We understand what you want, who you are. So this is, this depends on him because he likes it that way. Yeah. Because he's wearing this low-cut shoes, so he likes it that way. Okay. It's, the low-cut shoes are very comfortable. Yeah. So if if you're that if you're not that kind of a person, you don't have that personality. It's very. It's we just do the normal pants, normal length, 
where where you, where the pants that fit the shoe, mm -hmm. just cover the shoe exactly, look fitting and bespoke. Okay. Yeah. If someone wanted to brighten this look up, like beyond the tie, yeah. can you do like a, another shade of the suit with that shirt? Yeah, yeah. You can, you can, we can even do a, a bright color blazer with a dull color pants with that okay. shirt. Yeah. Okay. You can even do white, you can do yellow, you can do orange. Yeah. Yeah. I'm seeing like there's this trend of like gentlemen wearing like colored suits now. Yeah. Yeah. Actually, last year, one of my guests here, I've seen him in a purple suit and it looked really good. <laughs> a green suit yeah. as well. Is yeah. that, is that like even men now yeah. are embracing yeah. a lot more Yeah, color. guys embracing colors a lot. Actually, they are, like it's a process. L guys started working with that. You see like the, the olive green, uh, mm -hmm. jungle green. It's, mm -hmm. a, it's a dull color. It's toned down but still color. Yeah. Then they're coming to doing just a blazer with a with a dull color pant. Yeah. But a colored blazer, bright color. You can do yellow, you can do pink. Most of the guys I see doing pink. Right. You can do purple. Yeah. Purple, you know, we have different shades. We have dull purple, dull color shades of purple. We have brighter ones. So it depends on the person. But guys embracing it a lot. Okay. Even so, say the client who came in and said, I want a gold blazer. Wow. So I sat on and said, are you sure? Can you, <laughs> can you, can you wear it? Can yeah. you rock it? Said, yes, I want to try it. Wow. Yeah. And what about like the cuts of the jackets? Because I'm seeing like double-breasted uh, are coming back. I'm seeing people with like the low waistcoat, yeah. and maybe we can see the back as well. Because yeah. I remember at some point, are we back to like the double slits, yeah. Mara Tunona single slit? Yeah, yeah. Tell us about all that. Uh, the double breast uh, looks very, very slick. Mm -hmm. When you're wearing a double-breasted blazer, our suit looks very, very slick. You look mm -hmm. like someone you know what you are wearing, you know your fashion, you understand your body. Mm -hmm. uh, the low cut waistcoat, usually, it's when you're doing a, like a tuxedo. Mostly when you're doing a bow tie, is where you, okay. you do a low silhouette uh, waistcoat. Because okay. uh, it works really well with a, with a bow tie. Okay. When you're doing a business suit, you're going to a meeting, you do the normal V, the high okay. silhouette V, because okay. it works very well with a three piece suit. Mm -hmm. So, uh, guys, uh, this day, the double breast actually, guys are embracing it a lot. Yeah. I see guys wearing double breasted suit. Although they're wearing dull colors, or it's maybe a, most of the time like pinstripes, because pinstripes look very well when you're doing mm -hmm. a double breast, but they're embracing it a lot. It's coming back and it's working very well. Should people be concerned about like their body shapes as they do? Love that December or Likula Sana, Akonaka situation, Hapachini. Yeah, yeah. You, <laughs> you know, are there certain looks that maybe you'd say, okay, maybe for that one, yeah, stick for, here? For someone, uh, some, like you say, who has a big body, a double breast doesn't look very well because mm -hmm. most of the time you, you cannot unbutton a double breast. Yeah. You have to wear it all the time buttoned. So if, if you are, if you can do a one button, you can do a two button. And most of the time do a, a double cut instead of a single cut because yeah. a single cut when you're buttoning it up and you, 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 let me, you can say you're well endowed. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> most of the time the slit opens up at yeah. the back. So yeah. it's better to work with a double slit. Okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Well, thank you for demoing this look for us. Um, uh, very shortly now, I believe our uh, next model is ready. But um, for you personally, what are you thinking is going to be your style in 2020? I think I'm, I'm working with the power suits because power I'm trying suits. to get some deals done. Okay. We're trying to move forward in terms of as a company. Yeah. Because we're now an LLC, so we're trying Good to... Good for you. To, to work it up so because everyone takes you serious when you're you, you, you're well established yeah so we're trying to work that out we're trying to make this business a serious business a corporate okay yeah very good yeah. all right well our lady model is ready and so we're gonna have her come on she's gonna be demoing another power suit that you guys can rock in 2020 oh my gosh this is so cute <laughs> i love this one <laughs> thank you wow it's yeah. so it's it's fashionable <laughs> yeah, like you know yeah, what i mean like yeah. it's it's so on trend yeah. it's very classy yeah. and someone will take you very seriously yeah yeah and then at the end of the day after the meeting you can decide you're dropping the blazer you're mm -hmm. wearing sneakers and you're going out with your friends yeah you just walk the pull neck and the pants if the pants still have the details, it can still look very, very sleek and very yeah. nice. So you just drop the blazer and work with the rest of the outfit. I love the whole look mm -hmm. from the shoes to the everything. <laughs> Thank you. Um, and what I like about this is because I, I feel like sometimes people hate their official wear. You notice yeah. like after work, everybody's yeah. just ready. They're yeah. throwing their ties, yeah. they're showing their blazers because <laughs> they're not comfortable yeah. and they feel yeah. like they don't look nice. Yeah. But this you could wear 
even to like a tea with your yeah, girls in yeah, the afternoon. Yeah, a brunch and everything. Yeah, mm -hmm. any 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 kind of event, it fits in very well. You can even go to a wedding. You can even do a red yeah. carpet with this. Yeah. Just depends on how you're going to work around it with accessories and everything. Can we see the back? Yeah. Gorgeous, and it's quite. It's a long blazer. Yeah, yeah. So it's still, you know, modest. Yeah, like it's yeah. not like tight fitting yeah, or anything. Yeah. If it's if it's a high density cotton, we usually do a one cut at the back mm -hmm. to accentuate the curves. Mm -hmm. But because it's a stretcher, even if she buttons it, it doesn't. It doesn't. It, it just works very well. Oh, it's stretched. Yeah, yeah. Both okay. of them are stretched. The first one and the second one. So okay. that's, you see the pants are very, very fitting. Right. Yeah, that's because it's stretcher fabric. So you can just wear it. Very easy to wear. Very easy to remove. Yeah. yeah. And of course, she's paired it with a really cute pair of yeah. heels here. Yeah. What other sort of colors? Could someone maybe change the... Does it need to be monochromatic? No. no you, ca you, can, you can change the, 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 the inside uh, the pull neck. You can do another color. You can do a vest, another color. You can do a blouse at the end of the day, another color. Yeah. You can work with a hat. You can work with a scarf. You oh can my work gosh, with different color shoes. Outfit. Yeah. And then when you said hat, I was like, <laughs> yes, I see it. <laughs> so it usually depends on your creativity and how you and where you're going. Yeah. Yeah. So we have options. We don't yeah. have to do like yeah. a, a skirt all yeah. the time. Yeah. Yeah. Like because the two looks you've showed us yeah. have have all been about pants. Yeah. yeah. And again, I, I like that this is moving away from what we've traditionally been told is business attire. Yeah. Although to your point again, you do need to be careful which yeah. industry yeah. you're in, yeah. right? Yeah. So Definitely. If you're a lawyer, I yeah. don't think a a, 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 yeah. a high yeah. court judge would take yeah. you seriously. No. Like if you <laughs> if you showed up <laughs> like this, but um. For those of you who are out there, um, even this, you can even wear to school. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Right? Like, yeah. And I, I like that, w as we're saying, it's it's about building your brand, yeah. too, as a person. Yeah. yeah, what you're trying to encourage is the ladies who are building their own thing, they can be comfortable in coming and getting what, what they want to wear anywhere, anytime. Mm -hmm. So this we're trying to encourage because ladies are coming up. Actually, uh, most, of the, most of the companies are coming up are owned by ladies. Yeah. So that's a, that's a good thing. And we want them to wear... What they're comfortable in yeah yeah thank you so much you guys can let me know what your favorite look is i think <laughs> that one is absolutely my favorite look here Woo <laughs> i love that look really awesome you guys can let me know what your favorite look has been double two triple nine is the sms line ashok thank yeah. you as always thank for coming through much. to the show yes. um very quickly let us know again you know, for people now who really would want to experience this sort of style, you've talked about creating a new line that yeah. maybe would be affordable for yeah. most people. Yeah. So is there like a budget range to that? Yeah, it depends on the person because most of the time when people are coming in and uh, you, you, you're getting a new job or you're trying to change your closet, you usually come with a budget. So we have different fabrics for different budgets. So when you come in, we sit down, talk to you on a personal level, engage and you come up with the types of outfits you can wear in your budget. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. And yeah. how can people find you? We are Ashok Sunny Taylor Limited on every platform. Nice. Yeah. Great. Thank you so much. Thank Happy New much. Year to you. Happy we look year. forward to seeing you slaying it, man. <laughs> Clearly. Meanza 2020 Villa Mcheso. I Thank see you. Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. We're going to take a short break now as we get ready for our second hour coming up at 9 a.m. This is Full Circle with Joyce. Stay tuned.